Welcome to my channel, Joan's Junk Journals and More. My name is Joan. It is time to make some new envelopes for sending out some more happy mail. I will be cutting down pages from this huge book. Each page is just over 17 inches by 11 inches and will make two envelopes. First, I take the staples out from the center of the book, then cut the pages in half lengthwise and widthwise. If you never saw my previous videos on hashtag happy mail movement and want to know what it is, it is where you make and decorate an envelope from a book page or paper of any sort and then you put a few goodies inside. Then mail the envelope to me and I will mail you one back. My address will be listed below. I will also list all of the collaborators below with their YouTube channel and ask that you please check them out if you are interested in sending and receiving happy mail from them also. Please use a real stamp and don't go over one stamp. I will mail one back anywhere in the world. Also, please like and subscribe to my channel and let me know below if you will be sending me an envelope so I will have one ready to send back to you when I receive yours. Now that I have all my pages cut to size, approximately 8.5 by 11, I can now start to fold them into envelopes. These are so easy to make this way. Fold almost in half lengthwise, giving enough room for the flap of the envelope. Then fold over one quarter to a half an inch on the sides. Clip off the corners and a little at the center fold to which will end up being the bottom of the envelope so there won't be bulk at the corners inside of your envelope. You can glue the sides shut, but this time I chose to sew them together. 
If the receiver of these envelopes wishes to make a journal with the envelopes that they get, they simply need to cut the sides right at the sewing, just like with Kim's envelopes. I do believe that the sewing keeps the envelopes together better when thrown around in the mail. Thank you for watching. I love and appreciate you all. Hope to see you again soon.